Golf Central on YouTube is brought to you by the Paradigm AI Smoke Woods and Irons from Callaway. Hi again, everyone. Jimmy Roberts here, and this is your Golf Central update. Tiger Woods was in the press room at Riviera before teeing off Thursday at the Genesis Invitational, and here is the best of what he had to say. Ultimately, we would like to have you know, PFB a part of our tour and be, be a part of uh, you know, our, our product. But in financially, you know, we don't now. And so uh, with, uh, with SSG and the, the amount of monies that they have, uh, have come to the table with and what we initially had agreed to in, in, in the framework agreement, and those are all the same numbers. So um, anything beyond this is going to be you know, obviously over and above. And you know, we're in a great position right now and uh, hopefully we can make our product you know, better in the short term and long term. And just to follow up on Doug asking you about here, so what is the frustration level of not winning here given that you won everywhere around the world? <laughs> yeah. Like how, how, how frustrating has that been? It, it is frustrating in the sense that this is a golf course that has been, in, to me, been very comfortable you know, visually. Um, as I said, it's, it's a fader's delight from the, the tee shots, and I have, as I said, I've traditionally been a pretty good iron player. Um, but for some reason, I just haven't put it together uh, at this event, <clears throat> other than you know one time with a chance. But I, I just, for some reason, just hasn't happened. You know, hopefully it'll be this week. And the frustration. Obviously, you can see you can see that I haven't done it, and you're asking me the question. Let's get that mic to clear, and in the meantime, we'll go back to Ryan in the middle here. Hi, Tiger. Yes. Two parts here, kind of random. One, what's Josh Allen's game like? And then two, how did um, Lance end up on your bag? Uh, Josh's game is, is considering the, what he, you know, he does for a living and the, 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 the pounding that he, he takes on his body, uh, the fact that he's been able to play this game, and you can see the enjoyment that he has. And the addiction that he has for, for the game of golf. And um, he asked unbelievable questions today about how he can get better, um, that only athletes really can a answer, you know, ask those type of questions. Um, and that's what's neat about being able to play with, with athletes and see how their, their, their brain works. And we're, we're, we're very similar across the board, uh, whether we're playing you know, football or golf or, or baseball. Um, how we look at things are, are very you know, consistent. As far as Lance is concerned, I mean, uh, Lance, I had a, I've had a great relationship with him over the years, uh, going back to when he caddied for Cooch and when we played at the, at the President's Cup together uh, back at what, uh, Mirfield Village. In uh, all the years that we've been on Ryder Cups and President's Cups together and the times I've been able to have played with him in the same groups, very down to earth, very loyal, and uh, the f how he has conversated with his his players uh, through the years. I've obviously taken notice of that, and uh, we've had the same type of feels and how we look at the golf course and how we you know read putts. They're they're very similar, so I think it's a, it's a great <clears throat> we're, we're going to be a, a great team, and we look forward to the challenge. Go to Ryan in the back row, and then we'll come to the front. So Tiger, uh, straight back. Right in the back, Tiger. Yep. There's been, a, there's been a lot of debate recently about reunification in the game and, and kind of the best ways to do mm -hmm. that. Uh, <clears throat> what's your opinion on a potential pathway back to the PGA Tour for live players? We're looking into you know, all the different models for pathways back, uh, what that looks like, what the impact is, for the players who have stayed and who have not left, and how uh, we make our product better going forward. There is no answer to that right now. You know, we're looking at uh, very different, uh, varying degrees of um, ideas, uh, and what that looks like in the short term, you know, we, don't, we don't know. Um, we don't even know in the, in the long term what that looks like. Uh, but uh, you know, trust me, there's, there's <laughs> There's daily, weekly you know, emails and, and talks uh, about this and what this looks like you know, for our tour going forward. Can we go down here in the front right, Tiger, and then we'll go to the back. To Tiger, from a technical perspective, what are you working on in your swing to make sure it's competition ready? 
Uh, I think that more than anything that I try and do from a technical standpoint is making sure that I can still hit the golf ball flush and solid. You know, I, I don't have this the same speed I used to have. I don't have the ability to practice the same amount of hours. Um, uh, but I still do work on make sure that I can hit the ball out of, out of the middle of the face. And if I can do that consistently, one of the reasons why I, I really don't have a coach right now, um, the, the, what my body does from a day to day, week to week, this looks kind of different. Uh, I can't really model myself or, or fit any kind of model. And a lot of it is based on my, my hands and my feel. And I, I have built this golf swing uh, in what, the last few years, or four or five years, based on my hands and uh, what that feels like. And what that, what that looks like, it, it doesn't really, I don't, sometimes it doesn't look pretty, um, but I can still hit the ball flush. We'll go to Jim in the back and then. Yeah. Uh, Tiger, Paul. Jim Hill, KK in, in back. the back here, buddy. Yeah. Thank you. Jim, Good to see, see you again. Here. Yeah. How emotional a week can this be or will this be when you consider for you, basically, this is where it all started? Yeah, Jim, it's been, uh, it's been full circle for us, uh, for me, uh, to have come out here when I was, what, seven, eight years old, whatever it was, when Lanny won going away, and to come out here and, and play you know, my first tour event, uh, and my first introduction to the tour, and then for us, whatever it is now, what, 20 some odd years, 25, 25 years later, um, <clears throat> to have the foundation actually run and, and be in control of the, of the event. And <clears throat> I'm actually you know, hosting and, and playing, so uh, it's, it's an incredible week, and it's a, it's a great week for all of us. Okay, we'll go to Bob, hey. Bob Harry. Uh, Tiger, um, two things. Have, have you personally met or spoken with anyone from the Public Investment Fund, including Yasser? No, I have not. Do you have a sense for what their goal is or what their end game is in all of this? From what their representatives have discussed with us, um, yes and no, and because that, that changes uh, and that evolves you know, from a few months ago to what it is currently now. Is that is that hey, is that good or bad? Is that good or bad from your standpoint? How it's changed? I don't know if it's good or bad. I think it's it's it's, it's an ongoing fluid process. We have another one up in the back. Can't see who it is. Sorry. Hey, Tiger, Jim Gray. Tiger, I was wondering if having your ankle fused diminishes the pain that you have when you play, and if you could also describe your love of the game now in a different physical state as compared to when you were whole. Yeah, my, my ankle doesn't hurt anymore um, because, no, the bones aren't rubbing anymore. But then again, it's different. Then other parts of my body have to take the brunt of it, just like my, my back is fused. And so other parts of my body have taken the brunt over that. And you know, I have you know, two different body parts that are, are now fused. Um, yeah, it, other, other parts of the body have to adapt. And as far as the, the love, the love, I still love competing. I love playing. I love being a part of the game of golf.